Um, one, two, three, cheese is one of three games for a three in one Kickstarter campaign, which is launching on April 23rd. And um, they're all food themed. This one happens to be like um, charcuterie and cheese. Basically one of my favorite things. How could I say no to uh, partnering with one of these projects, right? So for one, two, three, cheese, Imagine that players are members of the League of Thieves, led by Anton the Mouse. He leads us into a heist that goes totally wrong. We gotta cheese it and scram. So we gotta get rid of all of our crumbs and make a getaway. Uh, the first mouse to reach 12 on the cheese ball track su successfully escapes and wins the game. <laughs> So without further ado, let's go on to the other scene and let's check out how to play the game. Hello, hello. All right, and here we are with the board for one, two, three cheese. So as you can see, we have the cheese ball track over here, a little spiral. It goes from one all the way to 12. And the object of the game is for your meeple to be the first one to reach 12. If you happen to have the review copy of 123 Cheese, this is different from the rules that have been given to you. Um, originally, it was at the end of three rounds, the mouse closest to 12 wins. And if you were both on the same um, number, it would result in a tie. Uh, with this one, at the end of the rounds, whoever is on 12, um, whether it's just you alone or if you are tied, uh, you win. You make your grand escape. So the big question here is how do we get the meeples from one number to the next? Well, if you notice here on the bottom, if you notice here on the bottom, it says zero to five crumbs, 6 to 10 crumbs, 11 to 15 crumbs, and 16 plus crumbs. So what does that mean? Well, you will have cards in your hand. Each card that is in your hand is worth two crumbs. That's a lot of crumbs. You want to get rid of your cards as quickly as possible. In your stashes, which are going to be laid out in front of you, these are worth one crumb each. So. Thematically, you're all mice led by Anton the mouse, and when your heist goes wrong, you're trying to like incriminate your teammates and drop all of the evidence onto them and kind of uh, feign innocence, if that makes sense. <laughs> we do have some lovely people in chat, so I do want to acknowledge them for a bit. We have May, who is going to be playing with us, and Michelle, who's also going to be playing with us. We have Ryan, hello Ryan, and we have Gary. Yes, this game is all about cheese. Now, how do you get rid of the cards in your hand? Very important. We're going to look at the player aid here to check that out. So there are three types of actions, okay? The first one that we are going to talk about is drop. This one right here is drop. So it says, play cards of a number that is the same or higher than the stash, and the color must also be the same. This game is not quite like Uno because it only really focuses on color, uh, on color, not necessarily number. Um, so let me show you what I mean. Each player is going to have a stash in front of them. In this case, May is going to be the red player, so this is her stash. Purple will be Michelle, so this is her stash. And I will be blue, and this is my stash. Okay, so I've taken out some of the cards to illustrate some of these things for you. So, for example, a drop. Let's take the stack of ones, for instance. And let's switch this out with a zero. So I cannot put 
these ones. All the numbers have to be the same if it's going to be a drop. So 111, 222, 333. And you have to match it to the colors. So I cannot place it here. I cannot place it here. It does not match with green. I have to place it here on the zero. One is the same or bigger. Okay, so I had to take this out because it was originally a two. That would not be a legal move because one is smaller than two. So if there is any amount of um, number matching, it would only be to make sure that your number is the same or bigger. So this is not valid. However, this is. Okay. You can also drop any amount of cards. So it could be one card, it could be two cards, three cards, it could be any amount as long as they are the same number and the same color. Very difficult. You can also use wilds. There are two types of wilds. Let me show them to you. Your zero is a wild card, but it is only wild for that color. Charlotte, thank you for liking the stream. Anton the mouse, your mousy leader, is also a wild card. So this here is Anton. He is a wild for both color and, and for number. So I could place these, this here and say that I'm using both wilds to be, whoa, Tabletopia. There we go. I am going to say that these are both the number one for placing one, 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 one. So basically five ones. <laughs> Everyone say cheese. So good to see you, Charlotte. Uh, if you'd like to join, there is the pinned comment down below. All right, does that make sense? This can be played in any order because they're all technically the same number. That is a drop, okay? We're just gonna scooch these off to the side. Does anyone have any questions so far about the drop mechanic? If not, I will move on. The second action you can do is called cheese. This one right here. It says you have to play three or more cards of a run in the same color as the stash. So again, we are prioritizing color matching. That's basically a straight. So you have one, two, three, three, four, five or one, two, three, four, five. Okay, so for this example, let's take a look at my stash right over here. Do you see how my stash starts with a three? This is a three of hearts or three red, okay? For a run, it does not matter the starting number. As long as you have a straight you can play it on top of the same number. So before, when we were doing a drop, I had to make sure that the numbers were bigger than the last card in this stash. With this one, I can play this because it's a different type of move. I can do one, two, three, four, five on top of this red three because it is a straight, this is a run. Runs don't care about number. They gotta go, they gotta blast, they gotta cheese it. Charlotte, I'm glad to hear that things are getting better. So that is cheese. You can also use the wilds 
in the same instance. So in this case, this becomes one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. They don't technically exist except for when using wilds to make them. Okie dokie smokies. When we're playing the stash, we are only paying attention to the very last card in the stash. You're not able to um, place things backwards or in between. Does that make sense? There are some special rules when it comes to the last card in the stash and what it's counted as, especially when it comes to the wilds. So here we have this beautiful run, but when you get to the last card, like right here, what does that mean? There's this zero here. So in this example, this zero would have been the number seven. It is not the number seven when you're trying to place on it because there are no other seven cards in here. You would treat this as the number zero. So you could do a drop on it, just like we did over here with the blue one. You could play a run of red, or you could, you know, do our last um, thing, which we'll talk about. Other cards that are different are these cards. If you look very carefully, it is a lot of fun, Ryan. You're more than welcome to join us too, if you'd like, if you wanna pop into the uh, Tabletopia link. This game is very quick. Um, most of the time goes into the explanation and clarifications. <laughs> but once you do get the hang of it, it is very, very simple. So we do have these pouches. Anytime you see a card at the top of the stash, that has a pouch, it's considered a reset. So for example, if this Anton card was at the end, just like this, you can play anything. You can play any number, any color. Same thing if five was here. This is technically not correct, but if the five was at the front, oh, like this one. Do you see this right here? If you're wondering what do I play next, if you ever see a pouch at the end of a stash, they are open season. You can place anything you want on that person. So be very careful and try not to leave yourself open for fives or Antons. <laughs> Anton being the mouse. This would be a very tricky situation. All right. There is one last thing you can do. Let's put this over here for now. And let's talk about that. So we talked about drops, which is the same number, same color, any amount. So you could put one card, two card, three card. We talked about cheese, which is basically a straight. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. Those have to be three um, three cards or more from your hand. Oh, let's talk about that. Let's back up for a second. So for instance, let's bring back the red example. This was three cards or more from my hand. I cannot, I repeat, I cannot take four and five from my hand and place it on top of this three and call it a run. That is a no-no because that is only two cards. You would need to add an additional card to make that a run. All right. Let's see. Let's talk about the last thing, which is personally one of my favorites. It's called Gobble. You get to eat the cheese. And if anyone's a charcuterie board fan like myself, you wanna eat all of the cheese. So basically, if you don't wanna do a drop or you don't wanna do a cheese or you just can't, you are forced to gobble, which is take a card from any stash, including your own, 
but then you have to play a different card from your hand onto the stash. What does that look like? These are stashes. Let's say I have um, this card in my hand and this card in my hand. Let's say I have two cards in my hand. I have, let's say I don't, I don't really want to do the other two actions. What I can do is I can gobble from any of someone's stashes and bring it to my hand, but then I am forced to take a different card and put it on my own stash. I don't recommend doing a five on yourself for reasons, but <laughs> you definitely can. That's, those are the actions you can do to get rid of the cards in your hand and kind of manipulate it. Uh, one, two, three, cheese is definitely a hand management game. It is a competitive game. It is not co-op. You're looking out for yourself, trying to cheese it and get away from whatever's chasing you, whether it's the, the cat from the kitchen <laughs> or um, the, the chef, whoever it might be. All right, are there any questions from the chat before I introduce the two streamers who will be joining me today to show you how to play? Going to join, just seeing if I can get it running. Okay, sounds good, sounds good. Then you would basically count up your points at the end of the game. So for instance, Let's just say this is my stash right here. I'm blue, so this blue maple represents my stash, okay? So this is two points on my stash, but every card in my hand is worth two. So this would be one, two, three, four points, or four crumbs, apologies. So if you look on the round scoring, zero to five crumbs is six points. So I would advance to number six. The other players would do the same and this repeats until somebody gets to 12 and escapes with our leader, Anton the Mouse. All right, sounds good. We are going to introduce the two streamers. So we have Gulitan with May, also known as May, and Mitch Streams, also known as Michelle. Y'all know and love them. They are my moderators and they will help um, show how to play the game. You, girls, you can mute now if you'd like. Hi. <laughs> That's May. It's been a while, Hello. May. And that is Michelle. Perfect. All right. Thanks. Well, huh? Char Char is in. Charlotte is in. Perfect. So while we all get situated here, don't mind me. <clears throat> there it is. Do you what? While we get situated and show you how to set up a game. Charlotte will get comfy cozy and we'll begin. So this game is possible to play with two players only. The setup would be a little bit different though. So I'm just going to shuffle this a few times. When you're doing three or more players, every person is dealt 13 cards. Okay. If, wow, all right. We're gonna change Charlotte to green. <laughs> and um, Charlotte, would you like to join uh, voice chat or would you like to stay in text chat? You can play Gary if you have access to a computer. So the first thing we're going to do to set up is after you get your 13 cards, you can sort them. I don't quite recommend this if you're playing face to face in real life. Because then the other person can kind of tell how many cards of one color you have. It's a little bit of metagaming. But since I can't tell your tells um, as if we were playing poker, to make it easier for you, you can kind of pick up your cards and rearrange them in your hand if that makes it easier. 
Um, I am definitely going to do that. <laughs> You're going to choose one card to put face down in front of your meeple. And if you two or Charlotte have any questions, please feel free to ask. I'm going to do this one. Oh, Charlotte! Charlotte! Yeah. Hello! <laughs> Welcome on in. Hi, y'all. Such a pleasure to have you here. You should see 13 cards in your hand. You're just going to choose one to begin your stash and put it face down in front of the green meeple. I've assigned you the color green. I hope that's okay. <laughs> that's cool. That it is. I might have <laughs> taken into account everyone's favorite colors. Michelle's purple, May's red. <laughs> <laughs> not like I don't remember my moderator's favorite colors. <laughs> oh, is this your card? Oh, uh, face down, love. So take that back if that one's yours. Is this your first time on Tabletopia? Yeah. Okay, so when you pull a card back to your hand, you're going to pull it like this. And when you bring it to the bottom of the screen, you should see your own color highlight on the bottom. So for you, your color green. So this... Yeah green three pull it back where are you oh right over here yeah so okay. click and drag it to the bottom of your screen until it highlights in green gary yes charlotte is in the same time zone as you <laughs> oh, okay. did you do it here i got you oh you got it you got it is it in your hand? Yeah. Okay. Okay, so you're, go you're going to choose one of your cards and put it in front of your green meeple. The green meeple's right here, if you can see my hand. Um, you're going to press F to flip it over first, though. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Yay! All right. Nice. So everybody hover over your own card. And when I say cheese, we're going to say one, two, three, cheese. We're going to flip on cheese. Ready? One, two, three, cheese. Oh, geez. Okay. Got it. All right. So these are the cards that are going to start our stashes. May has a red three. Michelle has a blue one, Charlotte has a purple four, and I have a blue two. So the first player to go is the last person who had cheese. So what y'all have for lunch? <laughs> um, not fruit. Cheese. Fruit. Oh, what was your last meal, I should say? Because we have different time zones. McDonald's. Fruit. You had McDonald's. <laughs> Did you have cheese in your McDonald's? Yeah, cheeseburger. You had a cheeseburger. May, what did you have for your last meal? Chicken nuggets. Chicken nuggets. Ooh. Ooh. So it sounds like you also had McDonald's, but you did not get the cheese burger. Um, I had spaghetti and meatballs, and Michelle had fruit. So the first person to go would actually be Charlotte. Cool. Ooh. All right, so... You get to decide which... Did you catch the explanation um, as I was explaining on the stream? No. No, okay. <laughs> um, I love you, Shark. That's okay. That's okay. We're here to learn. Um, so your, fir your three options you can do are here on this player aid. Um, since it's your first time on Tabletopia, if you put your hand over it and press space, it'll make it nice and big for you to see. Oh, well, well. Press your space bar. You see over here, um, oh, yeah. it's blue with the instructions. Mm -hmm. If you put your green hand on top of it and press space, you can see the instructions a little bit bigger. Oh, wow. 
Yeah. It's very helpful, isn't it? Instead of zooming in and out. So the first one is drop. So if you have, um, color is very important, first of all. No matter what thing you're doing, color is very important. So you have to kind of put together your same colors. Um, if you have a lot of the same number and color, you can drop that on a stash that is um, a number or higher. So for instance, May, if you have if you happen to have a bunch of red fours or threes or fives or whatever, you can just slap it on top of May. Or if you have a lot of blues, you can slap it on top of Michelle. Uh, you don't want to put it on top of green because that's you. The object of the game is to have less cards on your stash and in your hand. Uh, you can... Down. Sorry? How many can I put down in one turn? As many as you can. But for drop, it has to be the same number. So two, 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 three, 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 four, four, four. If you see a zero, that is a wild. So you can make a zero any number of that color. If you have a mouse, it is also a wild, but it's a wild for number and color. Hmm. You can also make a straight. So if you... Have you played poker before? Possibly, I don't know. Anyways, if you have number sequence, so if you have one, two, three, four, five, if you have three, four, five, anything that goes in order, you can place that in the same color um, on any stash as long as it's the same color. Or if you don't want to do any of that, you can take one of our cards and put a, pull it into your hand and oh. then put a different card on your own stash. That's called Gobble. Hmm. So I can place any same color on top of anybody else's card? Mm-hmm, as long as it's the same color. So basically, looking here, you would want- Oh! Right. Oh! Is yes, but um, my card is two, and your number is one. So it's not as- um, it's not the same or bigger. You can place it on Michelle though, if you'd like, oh. because it's the, yeah, that's drop for a uh, for run or when you're placing straights. It doesn't matter um, what number is bigger or not. Is that all the number ones you have in your hand that are blue? Mm -hmm. Yes. I okay. That are blue. Yeah. That are blue. Okay then um, it would be the next person's turn. So let's see, that is, that was Charlotte. So now it's my turn. I will, what do I wanna do? Ooh, okay, so for example, ooh, I can't do that either. Sorry, May. I'm going to place a run on May. So a run needs to be three. <laughs> Needs to be three cards or more from your hand. So I'm playing a run of four, five, and six, since that's a wild. So four, five, and six. When this is at the, any card that has a pouch at the top is a reset. So now May is open season. You can play any card, any number on her. <laughs> But it is May's turn, so maybe I should not have done that. You thought! Kidding. I'm May might be a little me. upset. <laughs> no! No! Not yet! Not yet. No? No, not no. yet. No? Okay. No. Not yet. Just wait. Oh, so what May did is she played a run on you, Charlotte. So she did four, five, six as well, but she used a charcuterie board. She used a zero to make it six. When there is a zero at the front, you it's basically just treat it as zero. Even though it was played as six, it is a zero because it's a zero at the top. So you can place more zeros, you can do any number or higher, or anything as long as it's purple. So that was May's turn. And it's now Michelle's turn. So let's see who Michelle is going to try to frame. 
Jake asked, does this work on mobile okay? Uh, not, not really. It's kind of, I mean, they do say, Tabletopia does say it works on iPhones and iPads, but through my experience, um, there are glitches uh, when you mix um, iPhone and computer. Let's see. Michelle, I see your, oh, oh, okay. Michelle drops a four on me. So she drops a single four on me, which can work because four is bigger than three. Good job, Michelle. It's back to Charlotte's turn. The round will continue until somebody has their hands cheese free. Like they've gotten rid of all of their crumbs from their hands. Okay, now I know how to, yeah, okay. Mm-hmm. Hopefully I do this right. So you're dropping a single five on me? Seven. Okay. And possibly this if that's right. Let me see. Oh, yeah, you can definitely do that. Ooh. So you're using the zero as a wild. So you're making this five five for a drop of a pair of fives. Mm -hmm. Okay, yes, you can definitely do that. All right, will that be all? You don't have anything else up your sleeve, do you? No. No. Okay, let's see. It's my turn now. I have... I'm so sorry. Ooh. Okay. Sorry, May. One. I'm, par I'm dropping three ones on you. Okay, okay. I see you, I, I see you. It's what I had. <laughs> what do you want from me? Okay. Jesus. All right, it's May's turn now. Let's see what oh, May is gonna do. <laughs> no, there's nothing. Me. Wait, 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 wait. Good night, Gary. Thanks for popping in. Erin, thank you for liking the stream. How are you? Uh, let me know, chat, if you have any questions. Uh, this stream is meant to do clarifications for the new rule changes for 123 Cheese. So um, please do ask if you have any questions at all. Uh, does this beagle? If I do, so I take your one, right? Uh huh. And then I would have to like drop something. Mm hmm. Have to be the same color. Yeah, right. When you when you drop from a gobble. So if you're uh -huh. doing the third one, it doesn't matter what card you place. That's the only cool. way you can really get something that looks a little funky. <laughs> a lot of times I'm like, how did you play that? And they're like, I gobbled. And I'm like, oh, okay. <laughs> okay. So now that May gobbled, she played this five. Why would you place a five on yourself, though? Because... Put it any... Because I gobbled. Yeah, but... This is just a strategy thing. It has a pouch at the top, which means you're open season. Shoot. So <laughs> you can, <laughs> but um, I would not recommend <laughs> placing a five <laughs> on yourself. I forgot about that. You can literally place anything. Boom. All right, so yeah, she plays a zero next to a one, which wouldn't be legal because this would be a drop, but because she's gobbling, it doesn't matter what she puts down. So May stopped running for a second and just like kept eating some of her own stash. <laughs> Michelle, what are you gonna do? Hey. You're hungry. <laughs> Very colorful. This game is super colorful. Michelle? Okay, so Michelle, you cannot place that there because it's not oh. the same color. Okay. It, this card does not have a pouch okay. on it, so you would have to match green to it. I found it. Ooh. Ooh. Do you have more than one one? One green one? Nope. Nope. I oh. have different color. Ugh, oh, it's the worst. Alright. <laughs> I know! Charlotte, you're up. Hmm. 
Who are you gonna frame this time? <laughs> hmm. So what happens when there's a zero at the end? I'm sorry? What happens when there's a zero at the end? No, zero? Um, so zero, you can uh, do same number or higher. Um, basically, you just need to make sure it's purple. It can be any number. But they, if you're dropping, it has to be the same number. So same number, but purple all the way through. Or you can do a run, which is like one, two, three, four. It doesn't have to be one next. It could be that number or higher. So you could even start it at like three if you wanted. Oh, yeah. Right. Yes, just like this. Oh. So okay. it four okay. is bigger than zero. Let me zoom in for uh, chat to see. So this is legal. So she dropped one card and it's bigger than the number that came before it, which is fine. This game makes me really hungry. Olga! Olga! Hi! How are you? Oh my god, where did my... There it is. 357 follow age. That's crazy. That's a long time. So close. So close. All right. So yeah. Is uh do you have any more fours or do you happen to have a five or six or a wild equivalent? Yeah, but different colors. Oh. Okay. So now it's my turn. Let me just save this camera. All right. Hmm, I will have to drop on you, Charlotte. I'm sorry. Here is a pair of purple ones. <laughs> uh, May, it is your turn. <laughs> no, 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 not there, not there. Yes, there. Oh. Michelle, uh, get out of there! Oh. <laughs> she leaves me open with a pouch. So she put a five at the end. So she dropped a single five, which works. The five has a pouch, which means the cards you can play after it are literally anything. Anything. Mm -hmm. And um, it's now Michelle's turn. So Michelle... Hey. Michelle has nine cards in her hand, and I'm a little afraid. <laughs> go, I'm... Michelle, go. Oh, there's a zero. Okay. One. Oh, she's going for a run. She needs at least... That's it. You need at That's least... It. Oh, unless you're making the zero a one. Oh, okay. You can do that. No, 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 it's okay. Okay. So I thought she was going for a run. So I thought she was going uh, to do I ran... zero... I ran out you ran out of cards? I ran out of the cutter. Yeah. The cutter. <laughs> um, if you have another color that works, you can put that instead, Michelle, because this is oh. that pouch, right? So you can put any number, oh, okay. any color. You want to take those back and do something yeah. else? Do me dirty, Michelle. Give me your worst. <laughs> I'm not going to score oh. very high this round. Let's see what you... <laughs> I got my eye on you. All right, there's three, four. That's it. No green. If you're going to do a run, it has to be three or more from your hand. So, do you have a five or do you have a zero? I do. I do have a five, but a different color. Do you have a zero in green? Nope. Do you have a mouse? Yep. Put the mouse. <laughs> Anton is a wild of any color and any number. So with this, she was able to make a run, which is three or more cards, three, four, five, and place it on top of me. Even <laughs> though it is green, she can do that because this five is a quote unquote reset. Good job, Michelle. And I'm still open season. Thank you. Because this <laughs> mouse has a pouch. <laughs> so it's now Charlotte's turn to do her worst. I do so want to point out. The mouse has a pouch. Yes. The you mouse has a pouch. Any color. Any color. Any, any, any number. Run. 
and it can be a run. What? You can do runs. Um, if you have runs, it can be what anything. What's a run? A uh, run is like a straight, so numbers in sequence. So here, Michelle used three, four, and then this was technically five. So could it go like zero, one, two, three, four, five, so on, so on? Exactly. I'm afraid. <laughs> oh boy, here it comes. Here it comes. Go, Charlotte. Oh, it's oh, purple. Oh, oh, oh. 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 Zero, one. And it, yeah, the only thing with run it is it has to be three or more from your hand. Oh, all right. It's officially a run. She can keep going. She can keep running for as long as she has oh, cards. She's going. She's still going. Oh my God. <laughs> keep in mind, um, if you have, if you have any um, charcuterie boards of that color, so if you have this one, this could also have been played one, two, three, zero, and that zero would have been a four. Or you can put the mouse just like Michelle had used it as a placeholder. Does that make sense? But this is also valid and scary. Thanks. <laughs> uh, no. I'm going to drop a single two on May. <laughs> Uh, Why May. you gotta be mean to me, Yats? I'm mean to you! I hope y'all totally wreck Why? me and frame me for crimes that I totally didn't commit with mm -hmm. Lord Anton. Like as if you story. as if you three weren't in on the heist. Come on now. <laughs> Alright, May, what do you got? Oh, May. Oh, oh. That's all. Okay, night. A single Mer uh, Merlot-soaked rind cheese. <laughs> oh, wait. Mm. Oh. I couldn't put that on you, Watts. Oh, well, it's okay. Okay. Michelle, go. You could not put it on me because it does not match purple. So it's Michelle. No, I had a purple. Oh. Michelle's attacking Charlotte. My, how the, t the tables have turned. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> She's like, I don't want to hurt Charlotte anymore. There's, I have no more purples. Okay, okay. Who's a, whose card was this? It's sitting at the edge of the table. I think that was nope. Michelle's. Michelle's that yours? I don't think I had a. I, I didn't. That's not mine. I only have two ones I already played it. I think. Yeah. I think it was when you switched. I think she switched the mouse for the cheese. Oh! The mouse. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Here, okay. take it, take it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Thanks, Charlotte. Oh. It's still there on the. Goes. There it is! <laughs> there it goes. <laughs> there, there it goes. Whose turn is it? Is it my turn? No, it's Charlotte's turn. It's Charlotte. It's Charlotte's turn. Alright, Charlotte. I don't think I've got anything I can play. If you don't have anything you can play, you can do the last turn, which is Gobble. Just want to make sure you don't have any zeros or you don't have no. any mice. No. Little Antonis. Okay. Uh, so you can take a look at our cards on the table. Only the last card on the stash. So for me, it would be two green. Michelle has a three blue. You can also take it off of yourself. You have a three purple, and I have a three purple. You can pick any one of these cards that would make your hand easier to play later and pull it into your hand, but then you have to place a different card in your hand on top of your own stash. That's called Gobble. Oh, Lord. <laughs> <gasps> Olga! Olga! Right, this seems really stupid, but... Oh! Oh! <laughs> okay. And now I've got a place one, on top. You gotta place one. Whatever you place can be anything, any number, any color, but on top of your stash. Right, this seems... Oh. Yeah, this seems really stupid, but... No, that's, that's a perfectly fine move. <laughs> okay. 
All right. Olga, thank you so much for purchasing the merch. Let's see what you got. I'm super curious. I appreciate your face. Thank you. Um, let's see the merchandise. You got a mug. I saw that you got the work and lurk mug. That's honestly one of my favorite things. And the work and lurk journal and smug fox. Of course, you gotta get the Mr. Fox sticker. Thank you. Aww. Appreciate it. We're gonna get you a star punch for the merch purchase as well. Yes. Olga said, thank you for all that you do. So excited for these. I'm excited for you to be excited about them. <laughs> Olga. Olga. Uh, and that's it. So after you place it on yourself, uh, you don't have to do anything else. And then it's my turn. Sorry, I got distracted with the merch purchase. <laughs> Apologies. Okay. Wee. Okay, so now it's my turn. I don't think I can actually do anything. So I too have to um oh, she's hungry. have to gobble. I'm hungry. I'm always hungry. Come on now. Uh, mm. I'm gonna gobble on my own. And then place this. Why? Please. Why? <laughs> Because it's your turn next, May. We'll get more later. Sounds good, Olga. Thank you. It's May's turn. So reminder for those watching at home, that's called Gobble. When you take one from any stash and you place a different card on your own. Shouldn't have said that out loud. There, Charlotte. Sorry, that was supposed to be for Ate. Yikes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> the resigned okay. <laughs> I love you. <laughs> uh, Michelle, it's your turn. Um, oh, she's going wild. And girl, <laughs> keep going, Michelle. Keep going. No, I'm kidding. No. <laughs> no, just straight up no. <laughs> <laughs> I only have a zero and a five left. Oh, that's, oh. that's smart. Um, all right, Charlotte, it's your turn. She sings as she's thinking about who to frame. <laughs> Man, I got so many crummity crumbs on me. Makes sense. I'm always eating while streaming. I would be the obvious cheese thief. Oh. Oof. Okay. I'm really bad at lining these up. <laughs> That's okay. It takes practice. It's all good. <clears throat> Will that be all? Just a single slice of red wax cheese? Could I do any red then, or does it have to be an order number? Um, you can make more red ones if you have multiple, or you could do one, two, three, or you can do one, zero, three, or one, two, zero, if you have a zero. Because zeros are wilds, and so are little mice. I have that one too, you see. Ah, uh, I see. Um, this wouldn't work um, mm -hmm. unless your one was a zero, or if you had the ones in between. So if you had two and three, then you could also place four. Oh, I see. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Got it. That's okay. <sighs> For now. Charlotte, I will give you a pair of red twos. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> I could do that because you have a pouch. Alright. May. Oh, can't do that. Aw, oh, man. <laughs> oh, wait, yes, I can. Can you? <laughs> okay. I see you. Dim, dim. I'm most definitely just getting one point. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Yeah. Okay. Michelle. Cheese, oh, Elaine. Yes.
Okay. That's fine, I guess. That's fine. Can I do that? Yeah, you can. Yeah, yeah you okay. definitely can. <laughs> that was just me being spiteful. <laughs> it's okay. That was a good play, Michelle. Um, Charlotte, would you like to go? <laughs> Lordy. Just remember, we all love you. Of course. That's why you're here. I understand that. Just Hi, not right Elena. now. Elena, if you want to join in the next game, you definitely can. We're playing until six. <laughs> uh, so it's Charlotte's turn. Because Michelle just decided to place a red five on me. <laughs> Sorry, Ed. <Aunt. laughs> oh, that's fine. <laughs> Elaine has a follow age of 356 days. Oh. That's a long She's time. Upset. You're also very close to your one year anniversary. Thank you for liking the stream. I know that five has just been put down. Mm hmm. But if I took it uh -huh. and put a four down, mm -hmm. can I put the five next? So if you're going to gobble, regardless of which card you take, whether it's this one, this one, this one, or this one, you have to still put it on your own stash. You have to put your uh. next card here, and it has to be from your hand. It does not uh. have to match anything. It's just whatever card is not the one you took. I do apologize. I see. Oh? Oh. But who are you apologizing to? <gasps> oh! oh. Uh. Okay! Okay! Okay, I see you! I see you! <laughs> she puts a single <laughs> card on you and you act like it's the end of the world. <laughs> No, because that works in my favor. Does it? Maybe. Okay. Um, I'm going to gobble. Oh. Oh no, it doesn't! Why, Ant? Why? Because I had a feeling. <laughs> I have to protect <laughs> myself. <laughs> it's your turn, May. <laughs> 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 She's gonna gobble and she's gonna place on her own. Okay. Ooh. Mm. Ooh. Mm. Mm. Shell, please tell you have a five. That's all I'm gonna say. No. <laughs> <laughs> May gets out of work and immediately gets slammed on. <laughs> All right. Fine. All right, Michelle, do your worst. <laughs> uh... Your worst. Another thing that goes on a charcuterie board. I do have that. A charcuterie board? Yeah, two. Do you have a, do you have a charcuterie board that matches with a color? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> 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 That's it. <laughs> see you, Michelle. I see you. Oh no. Do you have another red that you can drop on top of her as well? No, she does not. Just a single red? Yep. Okay. That's uh, it. Charlotte. <laughs> right. So if I was to have one that was matching with the last card of one of these decks. But I thought it. Yeah. If it's the same color. That would be a drop color. of one. Yeah. You can drop it. Sorry. Uh, that's okay. So yeah, this is Aww. called drop. Because drop is any number of cards. Whether it's one card, two cards, three cards, or a million. Um, as long as it's the same number or higher of the color. So you dropped one purple three. That's okay. Because I'm gonna play this on you, Charlotte. <laughs> oh. And I'm cheese free. So the person who started was Charlotte, but I took an extra turn. So now May, Michelle, and Charlotte have one last turn to drop the rest of their cards, or the rest of their cards in their hand counts as two crumbs each instead of one. Of you. 
Good luck. Oh, oh. <laughs> May's like, I'm getting out of here. Oh my god! Yo! Yo! <laughs> wow! Wow! Yikes! That, burn. that was such a sick burn. So May was able to do that because the card I put on top of Charlotte had a pouch, which means she could do any color, any number, and she had a run. She had a run or a cheese of one, two, three, four, five in green. And she just slammed it on her. Wow. Was not expecting that. Uh Michelle. Oh. <laughs> Michelle, it's your turn. Wow. <coughs> Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> you guys, Charlotte hasn't been around for such a long time, and you like waited. You like baited her to think she was safe on the first round, and then you just went like just oh. so, oh savage. At least with me, you were openly like you're not getting anything. Love you, sir. <laughs> Sorry. Oh my gosh. Well, Charlotte, um, is there a way for you to play your last card in your hand? All right. That is valid. You dropped a single four on top of... All right. So, none of us have cards in our hands, so now it's time to score up the round. The easiest way to do it on Tabletopia is to take one of your cards, highlight the rest of them, Charlotte and Michelle. Since you're new, I'll do it for you because it's... And as you can see, oh uh, May and I are just kind of putting it together. And then you can hover over your deck. Mine says I have 19. For Charlotte, let's put yours over here. <coughs> oh my gosh. Boop. Charlotte, this is your deck. If you hover over it, you can see how many cards were on your stash. Oh, yeah. Oh, one below you. I only have three. <laughs> Do you seriously only have three? Yep. Cause we were targeting her. We were targeting you. Know. you. How the? Okay. <laughs> so based on so if you look at the bottom of the round scorecard, really quick, this one over here, yeah. it says zero yeah. to five crumbs, which would be Michelle, right? Cause you had three cards. Yeah. So Michelle, take your purple meeple and uh -huh. add six points. You're on zero, so you would go to six. All right. Um, Charlotte and I had more than 16, so the two of us would just take one point. So. I'm so confused what I'm doing. <laughs> okay, so if you see over here, if you zoom in a bit, it says round score and it says the crumbs. That's how many cards we had at the end. Um, six. You had 19 cards on your stash, right? 18. 18, something like that. So if it says it says here 16 plus crumbs is worth one point. See how that's one point on the shield? So you're yeah. going to take your green meeple, because you're green, and you're going to move it to the number one, which is right over here. See the green meeple? I'm trying to zoom in. You can zoom in with your oh. wheel. If you have a yeah. mouse with a wheelie roller. Oh my goodness, what can I do? Oh, there we go. There we go. This one right here. <laughs> no oh, issue. Tabletopia takes a little bit to learn too. Do you see it? It's right here next okay. to this mousey. Yes, yes, right. yes. Where do Oop. I move it to? That's Michelle. This five is going to go to number uh, one. I was fixing it again. A little up. So I'm on number one. Yeah. Oh, number one is right over here. Do you see that? Oh. Sorry. Yes, yes, yes. Perfect. We're gonna share this yeah. spot. So right now, yeah. Michelle's currently in the lead because she looks the most innocent out of all of these mice. <laughs> <laughs> Michelle. Um, and... We're going to put the deck together again, shuffle, and do more rounds until one of us gets to 12. Cards for everybody. I'm going to deal 13. 
Good luck, have fun. Choose the card you'd like to put in front of your stash and we will, we will continue. All right. Oh my. Those of you watching at home, this hand. <laughs> this hand is quite something. <laughs> oh my gosh. What? I'm gonna oh. choose this one. Um. All right. Uh oh. Hey. Okay. Okay. All righty then. Uh, we're just waiting for Michelle to choose her card. This is insane. All right. Ready? One, two, three. Cheese. Oh. All right. All right. <clears throat> <clears throat> um so the person that goes first this time is the person who is uh lowest in the cheese ball track which is a tie between charlotte and myself so charlotte had cheese last so charlotte you get to go first again oh i was gonna do a head soft <laughs> <laughs> hmm. let's think Interesting. I'm sorry. Again. I have a feeling. Oh. <laughs> yeah. It's okay. She's dropping. Oh. What'd she do? Oh, is it a run? Hold Two, on. three. Alright. Okay, okay, okay. Alright. Okay. Four. I wonder if there's more. Shia, are you putting on me? No, she's putting oh. on me. Oh. Ooh, a five. <laughs> Two, three, four, five. Sorry. That's okay. Oh, <laughs> All right, so it's okay, mate, because you know what? Um. Oh no, I that behave. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six. <gasps> Your turn, May. <laughs> hurts. That hurts. I'm wounded. I'm wounded. As if you didn't do the same thing to Charlotte the previous round. <laughs> One, two, three, four, oh. five, <laughs> six. Ooh, you did Ooh. the exact same thing to me. Yeah, Spicy. So I said I'm wounded. <laughs> Spicy. All right. Michelle, <laughs> do you have something you'd like to do? Michelle's looking at this like, uh-uh. <laughs> So here, uh, May used zero as a two, and then Anton as a six. So this is one, two, three, four, five, six. That in it. Oh, this is a very spicy game. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. Okay. Oh wait, no, I can't do that. Right? Yes, you can. Okay. Because there's a pouch, so it Ooh. became any color, any number. So it looks like Michelle's playing a run of her own Ooh. in red. That's it. That's uh, it. Zero, one, two. Okay. <laughs> it's uh, Charlotte's turn again. So sorry. Uh oh. <laughs> there's another person with a red here who's in the lead. I just want to point that out. <laughs> oh. <laughs> 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 She's literally at six points. Meaning, <laughs> meaning. Uh, <laughs> oh, oh, I don't know. Can it go there? Yeah. If you can place it on me, you can definitely sorry, place it on Michelle. Michelle. I'm sorry, Michelle. I'm sorry. 
stop. Oh, it's okay. Oh, I got I it. I by accident. It's okay. I'll just pop it oh, there. Oh. There we go. You're fine. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, Love nice. you. Okay. <laughs> I see. All right, um, let's see. I'm just gonna leave this very tempting five right there on Michelle. Ooh. Ooh, ah. Yeah. <laughs> May? Wait. Michelle, I love you. I thought so. <laughs> oh. You can, oh, yeah. you need one more card to make that a run. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Never mind, never mind, never mind, never mind. Never mind, Michelle! You can drop one or the other and make it a drop of one. I only have one or two for green. Okay. Unless... Yeah. Okay. Charlotte? No, wait. Yeah. Michelle. It's Michelle. Sorry. Michelle was just getting placed on. <laughs> she didn't go <laughs> yet. Alright. Sure. <gasps> oh snap, it's a five. Mm. Mm -hmm. mm. It's okay. It's okay. That's fine. He's okay. Okay. Alright. No. What no. will you do? So what happens when you do zero? Zero is basically you can play any blue on top of that. So, zero on the top is any number of that color. Hmm. You can do what run, you can I've... do drop. What, what happens if I've got a zero? Your zero in your hand is considered a wild, so you can combine that with other things in your hand of the same color. Hmm. So to Depending on what zero color you have, that will stand in place of literally any number in that color set. Hmm. Do I need- I do not need 11 by 17 paper, Marcus. Thank you for popping into chat to ask me that. <laughs> Unless it's computer paper? I mean, I'll take that as scratch paper for sure if it's just there. Well, for now, I'm just gonna... Yes, then yes, grab it. Bit too high. Mm! Mm! Oh. Hold on. Look at where the shadow is. That might help you. Oh. Yeah, right there. There you go. That's a bit better. There's four boxes of 11 by 17 paper? That's crazy. E. Take it. What? <laughs> take it, Marcus, mm. take it! <laughs> he he Mar often goes on the, like, Craigslist of, like, stuff just left to die on the curbside. <laughs> he finds the most interesting things. Um, alright, so I'm next. I'm just gonna casually leave this blue five in, on top of me. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Love me! I do. That's why I want to make sure you have open opportunities. Mm -hmm. Oh. <laughs> the O from Michelle. <laughs> Charlotte, Michelle, I'm sorry. Yikes. Alright. Michelle, looks like it's your turn. What? Hello, Raiders. Welcome. How are you? Amy, welcome in from the raid. We have a raid happening today. Melevision raid. Welcome, welcome. I usually welcome you with uh, Mr. Fox the Puppet. However, we are in the middle of um, showcasing a game for board game hour, but you're welcome on in. We're playing 123 Cheese which is a game that I illustrated. Melevision Raid, there's Phil, there's Crystal. Hello, Raiders, welcome, welcome. We're playing a game on Tabletopia. 
Hi, Ol. Does anyone here like to play card games or like to back Kickstarter projects? Cyber Sea Games, thank you for liking the stream. Ol, we do not play Overwatch. <laughs> Um, let's see. Charlotte, did you uh, go? No, I think I'm still going. Oh, okay. Oh, snap. So sorry, Charlotte. Sure. Oh. <laughs> That's it. Mel, oh. thank you for the 25 stars. A new friend, Phil! Hello, welcome! Thank you for being a new friend. Welcome to the Shenanja Gang. Hello, hello, Melavision Raid. Thank you for always coming up with me to the Raid, Angie. So happy we can come see what you're up to. Hey, yes. Yeah, so if you'd like to see what we're up to, I'm going to do exclamation collab for you all really quickly so you can see who's playing with us and what we're doing. Phil, thank you for the like. So exclamation collab. So I am playing one, two, three, cheese. I'm doing the how-to and the rule updates for that. Phil, thank you for the share. If you're into Kickstarter games or stick cart uh, stick Carter Kickstarter projects, um, I highly suggest checking them out. In the in the bot where it says collab, we have the website of the game designers, um, sunrisetornado.com slash one two three cheese. We have the Facebook page and the Discord. And we have two streamers playing with us today. We have Mitch Streams, which is Michelle. Hello. Say hi, Michelle. There she is. And we have Gulithan with May. Who's May? May. <laughs> May May. Roll May. call for May. That's her. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we also have um, Charlotte, um, who is also one of my moderators from the UK, representing oh. the Insomnia Squad. <laughs> Um, with us. This is twelve. Oh my goodness. Oh. <laughs> oh my goodness, squirrel. Um, and yeah, so we're playing this little hand management game. It's um basically the theme of the game is that you are a bunch of thieves, um, your mice in the League of Thieves, your leader is Anton the Mouse, your cheese heist goes wrong. And you're trying to ditch all of your cards. That's Mel Star. You can ignore that. You're trying to ditch your cards and get rid of your evidence, aka your crumbs, and be the first one to um, get away and escape. I did all of the art and illustration for it. So here we have like any of the art of the cheese that you see on there, up to the pouch, up to. The cheese and the box art, it's uh, all shenanigans artwork. Yeah. Um, so basically, you're gonna just drop um, same number, same color, or if you're familiar with poker, you can drop straights of those colors, or you can gobble and eat up the evidence. And the game ends when you hit 12. And yeah, after this, once uh, somebody wins, depending on the time, we might open it up again. But yeah, thanks for popping on in and checking it out. Thank you so much for the raid. How was, uh, how was Breath of the Wild? You were playing Breath of the Wild earlier, right? Feel free to let us know how that went. Um, is it my turn while I was rambling with the raid? <laughs> I, I made that on Charlotte. <laughs> so what Michelle did, <laughs> is um, this does not match color, but that's okay because when you see these pouches, these pouch icons on here, uh, it resets. So she can play any number, any color. So she played a straight of one, two, three, four on Charlotte's stash. She's incriminating her friend Charlotte with four whole crumbs of cheese. Are you sure? <laughs> and it's now Charlotte's turn. We each have our own stashes as players, and we get to try and incriminate our friends and make right. it I've get doubled. away. Romero, thank you for the like. Welcome on in. I think we can do this. I don't know. You can play on yourself, although that's not quite wise since that would give well, you just, more points. I just gobbled. Oh, you gobbled. Okay. 
so I can put any card down on mine, right? That's correct. Any card, any color. So what Charlotte did was called a gobble. Um, if your hands looking like mine and you can't really combo them out, you can instead pull the last card of one of these stashes and pull them into your hand. After you do that, you have to place a different card down on your own stash. Okay. Uh, let's see. So it's my turn now. I'm not really seeing what else I'm going to do. But you know what? Let's just uh, leave this five over here on top of Charlotte. Fives are dangerous. I did a drop. You can drop any amount of cards as long as it is the same or bigger than the last number. And there's a pouch there, so Charlotte is open season, and people can do play whatever Please. number or color she pleads no. Thank you for trying to not spoil the game for me, Mel. I appreciate it. I'm only like Kofi nice to me. <laughs> What's happening? May, what did you do? Are you You were still talking, so I was like waiting for you to stop. Okay, so she gobbled my two, and she drops a red four on herself. Okay. Um, Michelle? Oh. You joined my Discord, or did you join the game designer's Discord? This is my Discord. The one in the collab one is the Discord of the game designer, the one who made the game. I illustrated the game. You will see me there, though. This one's mine. Of course, also I'm gonna keep the stream up but need to get food. That's exactly what I did, because, you know, I get it. Once you raid, you're kind of like, I gotta go get the food, I gotta do the stuff in between. Uh, but you'll be major lurking. Absolutely, thank you so much for being here, Mel. I appreciate you dropping everybody off over here. All right, what's yeah, the video happening? I put a, a single zero on Char's. Oh, okay. And that's it. Mmm, <laughs> charcuterie board. This was one of the hardest- this one took forever, because it's like basically yeah, like a bunch of like little mini pictures on one board. With perspective, I might add. <laughs> Very difficult. The best, though. Thank you. <laughs> I appreciate yeah. it. All right, Charlotte, what you gonna do? Yummy. Stay with me. I Char? Char, Char? Char, Char? <gasps> oh! Wait for it. Wait uh. for it. Oh, wait. Oh? How? Oh. oh. Interesting. Wait, Charlotte, the other way then, right? Oh, wait. No. Can I not? So this five is a wild only when it's on top of the stash. In your hand, it is still a five. You need to match the color, so you can do this for sure. Oh, can I? Yes, because so a zero, zero is a wild, so you can count that as whatever you're going to put next. All oh, right, okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, she's still going. Let me make you some space. <laughs> Not that one. Wrong one. She's playing a run. So this is zero, one, two. Three. Charlotte! <laughs> There we go. She's got to even it out, girl. You can't <laughs> run away with another six-pointer and just destroy the game. <laughs> True. <laughs> it's only 420. We still have, like, a little bit of time. All right. Well, that was Charlotte's turn. Mm. I don't know what to do. I will gobble... Oh. Oh. Hey, don't mind me. Don't mind me. Okay, I'm gonna gobble maze four. Just do this. Just it's me. Uh, Charlotte's like, don't don't look at me. <laughs> Charlotte's like, don't look at me. 
And I will play this um, purple too. Why, Oz? Why? Like, why? Where is my perfectly good point? Oh, wait. No, no, no. It's still possible. Is All it? All right. Is it? Is it? No, it's not. Dang. Okay. You know what? It's okay. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. Because. Okay. There. Oh. Michelle, um, your turn, oh, what just happened? Oh, I put down the three and the four, but it's purple on the two. Okay, so you have to match color, love. So you oh. can't place that on me. Ah. If it was a three and four of a red, you could do that if you had one more card. So remember that streets have to be at least three cards long. Okay. From your hand. From your hand. So you're not counting anything from the stash. You can place whatever you want on me, though. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> Just a or single one. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Okay. I saw Philip. Thank you. Uh, Michelle, who's actually playing with us, has uh, has welcomed you over there. Uh, we do animal teams on my Discord um, for participation and winning games and stuff like that. Um, so if you'd like to uh, be involved in that. I know all is Team Penguins. <laughs> uh, if you'd like to join a team, you're more than welcome to. Oh no, what was I doing? Yeah, but... Oh no. Wait, well, what happened? With me. Where are we? Are you sure? Sure. Oh, wait, how did this happen? Oh, no. Wait, sure. Is that oh, wrong? okay, I see what's happening. So, this would Is technically right? be correct. You could place cool. it like this, but it would be broken up into two moves. Whatever you play from your hand has to be in the same set. So these two don't belong together, right? Okay. But if this five was on top of me, for instance, not that I want you to play it on me, but this five is a wild anything only after it's placed. But it is a five, so you do have to match it to the colors so this wouldn't make sense or this or this but you can well, place I'm this sorry, here i'm sorry it's gonna have to go on you yeah that's fine uh -huh. but you cannot place the purple right after oh so oh. It, it's just like a single like haha there it is <laughs> you know what i mean um yikes okay i don't like that very much so i'm gonna <laughs> just take that real fast and uh, I'm gonna place this on top of me instead mm -hmm. oof yeah the fives are tricky because when they're on top of a stash they reset to anything but in your hand they're not a wild the wilds in your hand are mice and zeros they're like conditionally wild. It's strange. You chose the Mace wolf. Cop. Very nice. Makes cardless. May, how long have you been cardless? Just now. Oh. Wait. Right now, what? right now? Yeah. On my oh. move. Okay. That's why I said thanks, Oz, because if you didn't take that away, I wouldn't have been able to do the four. Yeah, you would have. It's a five. Oh. It's a pouch. But yeah, but it's... Oh. Yeah, never mind. That's okay. When you cheese, when you have nothing, just let us know that I don't have any more cards. Because otherwise I'm just going to wait for you to, like, wait for the next person. So May uh, is cheese-free. She has no more cards in her hand. So Charlotte was the first one to go. So how does this work? Okay, so that would mean... 
Michelle gets another turn. And that's it. Because it just wouldn't trigger Charlotte's next turn. But Michelle still needs to even out the turns. Does that make sense? Yeah. So, so Charlotte was the first one to go. I went. And May went. It wouldn't be fair to Michelle if she didn't get a turn to play too. So she's going to play something from her hand. And then we're going to tally up the cards. Or the crumbs. Is there anything else you need to do in the Discord? Ah, in our Discord, just let Michelle know and uh, introduce yourself. She tagged you. Uh, we just want to make sure that we're addressing you by your correct pronouns. So if you go by he, him, they, them, she, her, she, they, um, it, it's, um, just let us know what pronouns you use and we can adjust your nickname. That'll be it. Thanks for asking, Phil. Jack! Hey. Michelle, when you get a chance, uh, can you also do the nickname? I know you're juggling playing with me as well, but whenever you get the chance. Um, so what happened here? You played 3-4. played 3-4 on May. If you're doing 3-4, you need something to make it a 5. So That's you can it. only play one or the other. Because I noticed you only had oh. two in your hand. Remember yeah. that runs, runs are three or more cards from your hand. So you're only playing two cards, so it, you can't do that. But you can choose, do you want to do the three or the four? Oh, okay. Um, taking away the four. Okay. All right, so now this round is over. So I will show you on stream basically the same thing. I'm going to stack everybody's up except for May because I know May can do it. <laughs> uh, Michelle May. and Charlotte are a little bit newer to that. Girlfriend, how so, come I can't do it now? Oh. Yeah, okay, so you set it aside. If you press shift and click, you can select multiple cards. So you would do all your cards like that. So I have a shift button somewhere, do I? Yeah, you need to do shift. And then um, you drag it over on top of your cards until it turns this bright orange, and you let go. I'm there you just go. trying to find my shift button. <laughs> That's okay, I've got it for you. I don't think I have one, you know. <laughs> It's okay, Michelle. So, um, you want to select everything at once. That's what you're missing. Oh. With your shift. So, okay. shift, hold, click, select everything. Or you can select it one at a time. Now, oh, accept that one card. So, this one card's going to be used as your anchor. Does that make sense? Yeah. Dang, May, how much you got in here? Not as much as me. And right, now, click and drag it over on top of your zero until your zero card turns bright orange oh Ooh. you let go oh, too man. soon it's okay i got it oh okay. i think i found the key okay so shift and then you drag it over you're looking for a bright orange first and then you let go oh, okay there you go show on <laughs> hold on so we're gonna do I have three cards in my hand. These are worth have... two crumbs each. So this is two, four, six. Six plus 19. That's uh, 25. If I look here on the bottom, 16 or more crumbs, that's still one more point. All right. Charlotte, how many cards did you have in your hand? I've got a nine and a one card. You had one card in your hands, so that's worth two points. So that's two plus nine. That's eleven. So eleven is two points. So you're gonna add two points to your one with your meeple. And you would be on the three. Hold on, I'm just shimmying up with so one, two, 
There you go. Nice. All right. Ta -da. Yeah. Michelle had, ha you just had the one card in your hand, right? Yep. So that's two. And I have eight. eight. So that's two plus eight is? Ten. So you had ten crumbs, which means you got four points. So you're going to add four to your six. Oh, you got the little cilantro cheese ball. See? Mm. She's not winning yet. She's not Two at 12. More left. We could, there could be more than one winner. There could be more than one winner. All right. To get there, I have to have one, two. All right, so that was That's Michelle. Five. And then May was cheese free, so she just has 11 points, which is two points. And you already scooched up. And you went to four. Okay. Awesome possum. We still have not had a mouse make their grand escape, so we're gonna continue on. FJ, thank you for the share. Appreciate your face. I'm basically doing the same thing. I'm just putting them all together. I'm doing that by watching it turn orange on Tabletopia. Uh, when you're doing the Kickstarter, you're um, supporting a physical copy being made. So, you notice I have the cards with me. This is the review copy. Uh, there might be some differences between that and what we get at the end of the campaign. All right, Good. we're going to deal 13 more cards. Choose your one card to start your stash and let's see what ends up happening. Rawr, why? Rawr. Did you okay. get terrible cards? Uh-huh, yes. Yay. yes, yes. Uh, I see you once. Mm, I don't know what you're talking about. I haven't the slightest. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I don't know what you're talking about. Mm -hmm. All right, jeez. You speak <laughs> me. Sometimes. Wait, no, 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 not that one. Oh, she changed her mind. Oh, that was that was a super Rooney. Hi, FJ. How are you doing? Philly, thanks for joining the Discord. I see you uh, all set there. Michelle, thanks for uh, getting him all situated. You're welcome. Doing an awesome job. <laughs> all right. Now the question is, what card is Michelle gonna put down? Uh, sorry. Oh no, you were you were busy. It's fine. Uh. What am I gonna do with my life? Let's see. <laughs> this is really annoying. Do you see how these don't match up with anything? Really hate that. <laughs> Not a fan. Not a fan. All right, girls, hands on top of your cards. One, two, three, cheese. Ooh. Oh, same time, Charlotte. <laughs> nice. Everybody else is starting with ones. I missed the memo. <laughs> All right. In this case, the player going is the one who has the least amount of points. That is myself. So uh, let's see what damage I can do. It's so yeah. tempting. It's so tempting. I'm just lot. going to leave a single five on top of Michelle. <laughs> I am dropping. So I'm doing the first action, which is dropping one card. It is five is bigger than one. So I can do that. See that? There's a pouch on top, which means Michelle is open season. We can play any Raja says good day, Angie and Chad. Good day, Raja. Thank you for liking the stream. Um, so you can put whatever you want on top of her. Um, it is May's turn though, so we'll see what she ends up doing. Of course she takes it. <laughs> Yikes. Just one card though. That's it? Yeah. She's starting Sadly. off nice. She's starting off nice. 
All right, uh, Michelle, it's your turn. What would you like to do? May dropped a zero purple on top. She's able to do that because there was a pouch card before it. <laughs> Ooh. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> the more y'all see me play with these cards, the more my OCD becomes very apparent. I uh, know, I tried, but I didn't. Come it's okay, up. it's okay. I know everyone's trying. <laughs> this is a me problem. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> Not mad at anybody. <laughs> um, is that all? You're gonna drop a single three? Everybody's starting off strangely nice this round. Yep, uh, only a single three. All right, Charlotte. Because <laughs> who will be Wait. the first one? Charlotte's gonna be the one that's gonna be like. Z -z 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 -z. Yeah. Wait. I'm sorry. She's gonna do what? <laughs> I love that sound you made. Can you make it again? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That card. Who has it? Where is it? Who I see. I see the hand hovering over my my stash. Oh, a five. Okay. Okay. All right. I see you. Hmm. I'm just gonna. I'm gonna take that. Oh. Oh. And I'm going to place. A purple too. I don't like having that five on top of my stash. I don't like being open season. May. <laughs> no, no, no. Just one card? Suspicious. Very suspicious, May. <laughs> All right, Michelle. <laughs> Are you okay, May? <laughs> you alright, May? Oh, don't forget to breathe. <laughs> okay, I'm good. <clears throat> That's it. <laughs> All right, Charlotte. May I may, may I may or may not be getting hungry. Yeah, no, I'm getting hungry too. Char. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, she says all innocently. You're quiet. That's I was like, sure. Are you okay? She's thinking. She's a think, think, thinking. How far she wants to go with this? Do you have a third card to make that an official run? Because um. you placed two cards. You placed three and four from your hand. The two is already there. And what else do I need to pick? You need to either you need to have um, a two or a five. Or a zero purple or a mouse. Oh, sugar. Yeah, because see, you only have two cards. A run needs to be three or more cards. You can definitely okay. drop the three if you still want to. Yeah. Okay. I see how it's going to be. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> um, I'm actually going to take that because I kind of need it. And I'll put a one yeah. here. <laughs> I'll just exchange it. We're doing a little exchangey poo. Uh, May. Thanks, Michelle. You're so kind. Oh. 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 I see. A blue. Okay. Oh, that was stupid of me. 
Michelle. <laughs> so May gobbled. So she picked up something from her own stash and she put down a different card. The card that you put down does not have to match. That is the only time that is true for this game. It's now Michelle's turn. Uh, can we put anything on the one that is a wild or no? You can put a wild if it mat if your zero is a purple, you can put it on top. If you have a mouse, you can put it on top. But if you're going to continue playing from that wild, it should make sense with the with what you're matching it to. So basically, like think of it like you're making a little package with your hands. That package as a whole needs to make sense with this card. So, like before, Charlotte was trying to put a wild and then um, reset it and continue that way. You can technically do that, but it has to be broken up in two turns. So, if you have a wild and you want to make me open season, you can place down the wild and end your turn and hope that it's still there. Okay, yeah. <laughs> All right, that's fair. Uh, Charlotte, it's your turn. I am now open season. There's nothing I can do. I just have to sit here and hope and wait. Charlotte has mercy. <laughs> just kidding. So I can put anything on this. Yes, now that the five is on top, any card that has this um, pouch, you can do whatever you want. Any number, any oh. color. Oh. No issue. If you are doing a run, though, it has to be three or more. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, you're like, oh, yeah, that's not going to be an issue. Okay. Here's the third card. You can... It's fine. You can tidy up in a second. <laughs> Got you. All right, now drop. So she's doing zero, one, two, three. Okay. Do you have more? There we go. All right. That's fine. I'm Bye. going to return the favor. So let's Thank do you. two, three, <laughs> four, and five but five as a zero because this is a wild card you can think about it like a charcuterie board has all different types of cheese one two three four or five but when it's on top of the stash it becomes a zero it's not five does that make sense okay may <laughs> Mm-hmm. 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 Yeah. She says. Can I help you? Oh, did you take did you take that from me? Uh-huh. <gasps> Why, thanks. But that makes me nervous because I feel like you uh you have a plan for that five. So she gobbled. She took the five from the top of my stash and she placed the blue four on top of hers. It's Michelle's turn. No, that's mine. No. Oh, okay. Just playing Anton? Um. Okay, she's gonna keep going. Yeah, you can definitely do that. That's it. So you're dropping because two cards it can't be a run but you can oh. make this a three so you oh. can drop a pair of threes does that make sense it might also the... yeah you're gonna play gonna the mouse play on the free you're gonna play the mouse on top you can do this because this is a wild it's okay. actually meaner to put the mouse on the top because then i'm open season okay. does that make sense because this yep. this is nice yeah. you want to be mean okay <laughs> I got it. <laughs> you got it. You got it. You got it. Uh oh. Oh, that's okay. 
There you go. <laughs> All right. Charlotte. Oh, my goodness. Hi, Marcus. This one has sharks on it. Oh, it's the great white. I love it. There's Thank three you. boxes. Thanks, honey. And then I oh. got you this thingy. Oh. Thanks, Marcus. That's my boyfriend. I'm Marcus. This is why I can't have a work from home. <laughs> folders. Wow, folders, honey. I'm so glad. What's happening in the game, Try. everybody? <laughs> Try going again? No, it was Charlotte's I... turn. Michelle just finished. I think I'm on the place in the Uh oh. Okay. Get bustle. What just happened? Sorry, I was distracted I just, by a loving I boyfriend. I just placed the table on top of me. Oh, okay, okay. Interesting, interesting. So, let's do this. I'm going to play a run. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, no. I can do this because a run does not need to match the, um, I can't zoom in for a reason. Hello? Do you see how, uh, if it's a run, the runs don't have to pay attention to same number or higher. That's only for drops. If you're playing something that's like a straight, it can go on any number as long as it's the same color. Like right here. And now Michelle has a five I'm, on, uh, on top. I'm open. <laughs> and she's open. Yep. As you should be. You are about to win. <laughs> I'm trying to stall you so that we can catch up. Um, let's see. So that is my turn. May. Oh my god. Me. Yikes. Maybe. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. She would still get two points and a win unless <laughs> unless we continue to pile on her. So, Charlotte. Charlotte. <laughs> so it's my turn. Oh no, yeah, sorry. She's like, no, 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 oh. I need to go. All right. Michelle, what would you I like to do? Uh, 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 uh. Oh dear. Okay, Michelle. Okay. Oh dear. Michelle is playing a run on May. So one, two, three, four. That's it. And a five. And now May is also open season, but so is Michelle. And so am I. Charlotte can just choose whoever she wants. <laughs> Ooh. Will that be Thank all? You. Yeah. Yes. <sighs> okay. May. I play yeah. a one red. <laughs> Oh, you're about to be hands free. That's not gonna work. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. That panic. <laughs> it's fine. It's She's fine. gobbling what? off of Charlotte's stash and adding a five on top of her own. Oh, I have a plan if it's gonna work, but I don't um, think so. Um. Okay. Um. Michelle, it's your turn. Oh, okay. That's it. Why, thank you. That was very kind of you, Charlotte. Draco. <laughs> and last card, too. Oh, it was. Oh, you have last card. No, I have, yeah. I okay. have one more. Ooh, where is she going? Uh oh. Oof. Oh, yes, because it's any color. So, Charlotte is making her <clears> stack <throat> blue. Okay. All right. 
I will put a five on top of Michelle. I am cheese free. Um, I was the first person who went, but I did take an extra turn, which means you all have one more turn. Because I was the first person who went and I went again. That means May, Michelle, and Charlotte both have another turn. Do my plan. Oh, oh, whoa. Hello. Oh, yes. Ariat. Hold on. There. She was a little excited. Boom. She's doing one, two, Jeez. three, four, five. And she's also cheese free, so she has nothing in her hands anymore. My god, this is long. Wow. Yeah, wow. Oh. Wowie. Wow. Um. <laughs> All right, uh, Michelle, it's your turn. You have one card in your hand. Yeah. No. Can I or no? I don't know. What is it? What is it? You cannot. Oh. Because it is not okay. the same color. You'd have to put it on me. I can't. Or yourself, but I don't think you want to do that. No. <laughs> yeah, look at me. <laughs> <laughs> no. Um, Charlotte, it's your turn. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The humming. Oh. Okay, okay. So she's matching. Very cool. And that's it. So everybody stack your cards together and I'll help you, Michelle. <laughs> I'll just uh, take care of that for you. Yeah, yes, please. Okay. So again, you just kind of take one to anchor it. Select all by using oh. your shift. And then you hover over your cards to get the orange. Michelle, you have 22 cards. Yeah. You got it. I'm determined to try and do it. You got it. <laughs> oh, my plan didn't work. I have 12, so let's see, 12 on the bottom is 2, so 1, 2, I'm on 4 now. May, did you move yours already? Yes, ma'am. You got 2 I points. I got 12. You also had 12. Oh, it's not going good. That's okay. If you have a low amount of cards, you can also do control and click each one individual. oh sorry, shift, and click each one individually. Uh huh. Sorry, I, I misspoke. It's shift. Am I not shifting though? You press and hold shift and click. Don't let go until you have all the cards you want. Um, no. M Michelle, you should have gotten like 22, right? Yeah. So which is 16 or more, so you still move one. Okay, we're good. You're not at 12 yet, but you will be at the end of the game. At the end of this oh. round. Because it's basically confirmed. So this is basically to see if May can somehow catch up to you and get six points. One, two, three, four, five, six. Charlotte and I are already not going to make it. The light at the end of the tunnel is dimming. But May has oh, a no. chance if May can somehow get less than five crumbs. This you guys will... don't torture me, yes? This will be my last um, one because I gotta get dinner. Mm hmm. Yeah, this will be the last <laughs> one for sure. Regardless of how many cards you get, you're gonna get a. You're going to have a 12 points, which is what you need to win. Okay. You got it, Char? No, I can't do it. I give Aww. up. It's okay. It takes practice. So basically, I'm holding shift. And then I click and right. drag to select over. And okay. then you hover over the anchor card okay. until it turns bright orange and let go. Charlotte okay. has only four cards. So Charlotte on four. the track. Four, 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 four. I've got two cards left. Oh, you do. The crumbs. The crumbs. So this okay. is two, four. So you have four from your hand plus another four. So that's eight, eight. crumbs. 
which means you get four points on the cheese ball track. So you are green, you're number three, so you'll be mm -hmm. on seven. Oh, I'm the only one that doesn't have a chance. Charlotte also oh. has a chance. Charlotte and May have a chance to make it to freedom. I'm stuck with my cheese, y'all. <laughs> Wouldn't have it any other way. I'm consolidating the deck again. Can't forget these two. And we're going to shuffle. And shuffle again. And give everybody a dealing 13. If you are playing as two player, you give everybody 15 cards and you work with two stashes at a time. All right. <laughs> I hope you enjoy the cards of your last meal. Oh Lord, all right. This is vicious. Oh my God, what is this? Okay. I have chosen my card. What is this? Why is this? Why is this? Oh uh, gosh. Okay. Why? Uh, yeah. All right. Yuck. Yeah. Yuck. All right, everybody, hands over your cards. One, two, three, cheese. Woo! That was cool. The three of you got it at exactly the same time. That was really yeah. awesome. Was that a stream? Can somebody go? No, I'm kidding. That was really neat. <laughs> Um, it's the person with the lowest cool. amount of cards. That was really cool. Um, and I will go first. Um, well, since I know Michelle is already going to win, I'm not going to bother. Personally, I'm not going to bother her too much. So I'm going to go on May. I'm going to do one, two, three, and four. Again, when you're playing a run, it does not matter what your first number is. I'm using a zero to be the placeholder of the two. Does that make sense, Charlotte? I see you looking here. So it matches the color. It's a run yeah. or a cheese. So it doesn't matter if it's smaller than this one. And then the zero is used as a placeholder because it's a wild of the color. Okay. Got it? Okay. May, it's your turn. As I just. <laughs> the silence after the betrayal. <laughs> so sad. I see you. All right. That's fine. It's fine. Fine. Okay. Fine. What is your team? I did better than last time, so I'm proud of myself. Maymay, -may, it's Charlotte, yeah. not yours. Oh, oh, shoot, sorry. <laughs> Wait, no, it is your turn. Because okay. I went, and then it goes up here and it's red. Oh, okay. Yeah. So, May did oh, on right. Charlotte. Uh, zero one one. This zero becomes the third one. So she did a three of a kind in purple. She did dirty. <laughs> She's like, no, nah, she did dirty. Call it right. <laughs> it is now. Uh, so I went. May went. Michelle, it's your turn. Sorry, May, about that. I was a little bit. <laughs> it's okay. It's all right. We're going by meeple Love order. You. Oh, hello. Hello. Okay. Okay. I see you. <laughs> Love you. I'm already like a goner. I'm already like, yeah, give me more cheese. I want more cheese while I'm in rat prison, whatever that is. <laughs> Red's one of my favorite colors. That works too. Uh, it is now Charlotte's turn. Oh, snap. Oh. oh. Okay. Fine. Go Charlotte, if you escape, tell the <laughs> cheese gods I love them. <laughs> the cheese gods. I think I can do this. Yes, you can. Yeah. 
Yes, you can. This is called a drop of a three of a kind. So you did two, two, and then the zero also counts as a two, so you drop three cards of the same kind. Absolutely, you can do that. It's my turn again. Shouldn't I put one pack some? <laughs> well, if you insist. One, oh. two, no. and three. No! <laughs> no. Alright. Um, May, it's your turn. Do I want to be evil? Or do I want to no. be evil? No. No. <laughs> Everyone's like, no. <laughs> Do I wanna be evil or do I wanna be evil? Are Look how nice Shirley? all of these colors are. They are, are. Shirley? Yeah. Are they or Shirley? I'm already gonna lose. Are they or Shirley? I love you, Oh, all right, oh. thanks. That wasn't so bad. Are you done? Yeah. Okay. So I have that a plan. Do you? All right, so that's uh, May's turn. Michelle, it's your turn. I wonder what Michelle is going to do. Oh, snap. That's it. All right. It's Charlotte's turn. Oh, I'm so sorry. That's okay. Oh, a red. Oh. Okay. I think I don't. I can do. I don't know. Can I do it? Let's see. What do you have? What do you have in mind? Right. But so I want to keep. It. I don't know if I can keep it going. Let's see it. No. Okay, so you're either no. doing um, the same number or a run. You can't do both. Okay. You have to choose. Okay, okay then. Okay then. I'm gonna... You could use this zero mm -hmm. and put it here yeah. if you need it to like complete something in your set. Because... Oh, okay. There we go. Cool. Alright. So you did zero, one, two, three. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Okay. So this is a run, and she could play that, even though it's a different color because this five has a little pouch. Alright. Uh, it's my turn. I don't know what I want to do. What do I want to do? Mm -hmm. I don't want any of your cards either. I guess I'll gobble. And I have to put yeah. down my own card. Ooh. Okay. May it's your okay. turn. Okay. Do I want to do this? No, I don't. Do I? I don't know. I don't know. Do I want to do this? I don't yes, know. yes, I do. Ooh, a five on Michelle. I'm open. You are open. <laughs> are you gonna let her keep you open like that? May, is that all you have? Sadly. Okay, Michelle, it's your turn. What you gonna do about this? Oh snap. Uh. Did you just play that green three on me? Yep. Yep. Anything else? Uh, I do a different free on a different color on the. Isn't it to free or no? Um, if you're playing it, it has to be the same color. So, do you have any other green threes, or do you have a zero that's green, or do you have a mouse? No. Okay. Then I'm no. done. You're done. Okay. Uh, Charlotte. Oh, okay. Ooh. 
So she's playing a run of one, two, three. All right. And then toi. I still don't want any of these cards. <laughs> um, uh, I'm gonna... There's so much green up here. Oh wait, yeah. Michelle, I'm gonna play oh. one, one, one in blue. Ooh. Okay, May. So I went, now it's May's turn. What am I missing? Hello? Oh, okay. Oh, what? <laughs> <laughs> she took it away. <laughs> she took it back. She's like, nah. <laughs> oh, geez. Okay. That was May, right? Yep. Michelle, it's your turn. You are a wide open girlfriend. I know. I know. <laughs> oh no. Ooh. Charlotte's got all purples. Oh. Charlotte's open. Uh, but you played only two oh, cards. Wait. Yeah. Hang on. Do you have can a. Can I put the three down? You can. Okay. We have to put That's the three first. Yeah, there we go. Okay. <laughs> There now is. she's open. Now oh. Charlotte's open. You're both open, technically. All right, Charlotte. Yep. What you gonna do about that, Charlotte? What am I, going to do? What am I, going to do? I love how she just um, sings it off. I love um, it. Oh, this might sound stupid, but that's yours. Anna. She's like, I'm aware. It's not, though, because, oh, okay. I mean, at the end of the day, if you have <laughs> cards in your hand, if you play it on yourself, there's still less points at the end because oh. they're worth more and they they're worth more crumbs in your hand than they are in your own stash. So sometimes if it's like really late game and you really don't see any other way out, just like putting it in your own stash might make sense. She's also protecting herself from this pouch. Oh, okay. You know? Because yeah. otherwise people can just do this. <laughs> and just... <Yeah. laughs> and play on you instead. Um, that's my turn. May. Go, May. She is thinking. What's she thinking? I don't know what she's thinking, but she's definitely thinking. She's Ooh, gonna place she it from? on Michelle. Ooh. This is an interesting play. So she's dropping, and technically zero is not more than three, but zero is wild. So she can make it oh, three, four, or five. But Regardless of what number she picks it as, once the turn passes, this becomes zero again in terms of what's on top of the stash. Good play, May. Have I been muted this whole time? Yes. <laughs> I wasn't sure if that was intentional or not, or I wasn't about to call you out on it. But <laughs> My plan did not work. <laughs> oh, okay. Uh, so that was May's turn. It's Michelle's turn now. Michelle has four cards left in her hand. This this round is very even in terms of everyone's stashes. Very interesting. Yeah. Oof. Okay. 
I see you. <laughs> All right, Charlotte. Do you know how in bingo they say bingo when they win? When they win or when you're cheese free? We've just well, yelled I'm... cheese free, but it's not like official. Well, it's just I'm something just fun. Go... Cheese. 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 <laughs> Cute. I <Yeah>. love you. <laughs> It can be basically anything. We haven't put anything official in the rules. It's a really great question. Um, uh, Happy and I have adopted and saying cheese free. Um, you can say cheese. You can. It's but none of that's official, um, as far as I'm aware. Um, so I was the first one who went. This is a great example of no one getting any other turns. So since I was the first one who went, and Charlotte was the one who became cheese free, I would not go. And nor would anyone oh. else because yeah. we wouldn't want the extra turn. So yeah. I'm just stuck with the cards in my hand. That's why I said my plan did not work. <laughs> so everyone tally up your stuff. Right, what did you do again? All right, so you have your anchor card here. It might work better if it's a little bit further from you, like right here and not like in the way okay. with the maple. So press and hold shift. Press and hold shift. Do not let go of shift. You're also going to click and drag across only your purple cards. There you go. You selected them all. Now click and drag. Don't let go. And hover over the zero or your anchor card until it turns a bright orange. And then when it's bright orange, then you let go. There you go! Yeah. To move your... Oh, yeah, yeah. oh no. Uh -oh. Put no. it back. No. Make it turn oh, orange again. It's okay. Oh, no. I got, I got it. To move your entire deck, you click, let go, and then you click again and drag. Oh, no, 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 no. Click. Uh-huh. Well, click again. There you go. And now you can drag it to where you want it to go. Oh, I'm getting there. There you go. See, it just takes some practice. Yay, you did it. I'm so proud of you. Okay. Uh, who's over here? Michelle, honey, you okay? Okay. You... So click. Click it once. Uh-huh and let go so i can see that your hand is still grasping it so you need to let go and then click it again and then move it there you ah. go there you go good job all right so i had one card in my hand so that's two plus the 14 so that's 16 i only get up one more at least i was able to get to the cilantro cheese <laughs> Oh. You got right. the cilantro. You win it. Oh. No, no. The cilantro oh. cheeses are on five and ten just for good um, marking. Michelle, you had three cards in your hand. So that is yep. six crumbs plus 12. So that's 18, uh, which is one point. But you reached Anton. That's exciting. Let's see if the others caught up with you. Charlotte no, was cheese free. Mine. Oh. I was on number seven. I got 11. I got two points and I'm on number nine. So yeah. close, but no cigar. Okay. Charlotte oh. got one ahead of me. Because I got um, two cards. So now that one of the meeples has come with our leader, Anton. Michelle has found salvation in her grand escape. Yay. Um, and the rest of us get caught by the cat or something. I don't know. Oh. Wow. <laughs> um, but Michelle wins the game and gets away cheese free and successfully incriminating the rest of her comrades in this cheese heist. And the game is over. My first, my first time winning. <laughs> your first time playing and your first time winning. Yeah. Yay. Oh goodness, Joe? what a game. That was crazy. Thank you for joining us. Ugh. It's a lot more fun with so many more friends.
It's so. been a while. Yeah, it has been. Um, if you are in the chat, just a little bit of reminder. I'm going to do the collab for the exclamation collab for all the relevant links. So the first three links are from Sunrise Tornado. That's the company that is making 123 Cheese. This game does not exist yet. It needs your help to exist. Um, it will be launching on Kickstarter on August 23rd. You can see updates on the website, which is sunrisetornado.com. You can also see the other two games um, that go along in this Kickstarter. So 123 Cheese is one of the three-in-one Kickstarter campaigns. The other food themes are boba and um, a little fish market run by cats. It's very cute. 